Today, we're going to be going over what the names of these black keys are. All right, so we remember the notes, right? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, and then it repeats A, B, C. Now, I'll, I go over that in a different video, so check that out first. But I want to look at this note, because remember, this one is middle C. So, the note right next to middle C is raised a semitone. Now, you can check out my video on semitones if you're confused what that means. But this key is called C sharp. It's a semitone higher than middle C. However, it also has another name. And this is, this is where the black keys kind of get confusing. So it's called C sharp because you're going up just a little bit up from C. But if you look at this note, this is D. Now, from this guy, this note's a little bit lower than D. So we call this also D flat. So flat means we're lowering a note by a semitone. A sharp means we're increasing or heightening the pitch by a semitone. So going up, sharp, going down, flat. So this is both C sharp and D flat. All right? So remembering that, let's look at this next one. So now we can go up from D, one semitone up from D. This is D sharp as well as E flat. We go down one semitone from E to E flat. Now there's no black key here, right? We just go E, F. However, music is tricky because we can do E flat, right? But we can also do E sharp. But you're like, wait, isn't that F? You'd be right, it is F, but it's also E sharp, right? Because it's one semitone higher than E. So it becomes E sharp and F. So F is kind of special. It also has two names. All right, next guy. This one, we're on F, we'll call this F now. F to F sharp, up one semitone. Or from G going down one semitone, called G flat, G flat. All right, next one. You'd probably expect it to be G sharp. Or coming down from A, A flat. All right, now we're on this one. So A sharp or A, oops, sorry, or B flat, right? Up on B now. B, drop a semitone, B flat. All right, now we have the same thing that happened here. We do have a B sharp. Oh, but that's C. Yes, but when we raise something, a semitone, it becomes a sharp, right? And it, this also works in the reverse, right? We have C, and if we lower C, a semitone, it would become C flat, or what we know it as, B. So music's kind of funny that way, in that there's a kind of a little bit of a problem in E and F and B and C. Everything else kind of makes sense, right? You go down or you come up, but here they trick you a little bit. An F, you know, normal plain F can also be E sharp. Normal plain E can be F flat. It's pretty crazy stuff.